So we move on to Max Perot. He's won this event six times. 13 X Games medals. What's he got on his first run? Cap triple 1800. Tag him and bag him. That's a landed run right there. I think that is going to put him up in the conversation with Rene Renacongas. I don't know if Max's cab 18 triple beats Rene's score of 41. It's going to be really interesting to see where they put him. I love those slow-mo shots with what Gimbal God just shot. flying through the air. We saw Max do that cab triple 16 in practice, or in uh, men's slope cell. He fell in that practice with a little bit injured, but he's a tough kid. He's back out here. You called it a 40 for Max Perot. Not quite as far as Rinnecar. So here's Max Perot sitting in third, had a very good 40 on his opening run. So calculated, understands what to do, how to game plan this event better than probably anyone. That's how you do it. Put two up, hey? Put two up. That's what Max Perot has just done. He had that cab triple 18 to garner a 40. Here he puts down the front side triple 60. I don't think this is going to be in the 40s, but it's going to be high 30s. I'll tell you that for free. What's crazy about this is he can probably take that front side triple eight, front side triple 16. We just saw add another 180, make that front triple 18. Big air gold medal in Norway. That was his last big air gold medal. Brando Max has got that 40 right there for the cab triple 1800. Loved it. He did the cab triple 16. And here he pumps it up. Oh, no. oh no. I already rode home. We were celebrating in the spray. Oh. Max Perot, I don't think you can do a front triple 18 better than that. I refuse to believe that he didn't ride away from this. I am still in disbelief. Watch this. Puts it down, face down. I got it. Got it, got it. But net, there was net. a little bit, somebody had must have caught a little bit of an edge there. Watch his toe edge get caught in this little chunder. Bye. Oh, heartbreak. That's sticking your tee shot within an inch and then it rolling off the green right there. With Max Perot, the most dominant man in this discipline, he's been close on his last couple of attempts. Cab 18 got him that 40. Yes. Last run, he tried the mirror of that, the front 18. 1,800 degrees of rotation. He puts his board down, lands it perfectly, then falls. But not again! Okay, okay, okay. I really want to take a look at this landing here, because sometimes on the follow cam, that little check in the landing yeah. is uh, really magnified. So if we get another look at that landing, I think we'll be able to tell a little bit of a better story. Great takeoff. On the front side, triple cork, 1,800. Let's have a good look at yeah, it right let's here. Let's see how clean this was. Puts it down. Rocks to the heels, and that is, that's almost full 90. So we turn our attention now to Max Perot. Sitting in that bronze medal spot. Could this be his last chance to climb? Give it to him! Wow. Give it to him right now! Or else I am going to be upset. Right in the midst of the pressure cooker with 30 seconds to go. Max Perot does that. Front side, triple cork, 1800. Snaps the takeoff, gets the grab, goes off axis, off kilter, whatever you want to call it, three separate times, rotates 1800 degrees and lands like a butterfly on a cherry blossom tree. That was poetry right there.